Hello and welcome to my channel Science Query. I am your host Dr. Asha. In this video, I am going to discuss about protein digestion. Proteins are complex compound made up of nitrogen. Proteins must be broken down into smaller unit before being absorbed by the intestine. The breakdown of protein starts in the mouth when you chew the food. You can call it as the first step where the simplification of protein starts, but protein digestion still not started. The protein digestion started in the stomach where there is enzyme pepsin which helps in breaking the protein into polypeptides and amino acid. This polypeptide and amino acid goes into the small intestine where there are enzymes like trypsin, chymotrypsin and elastase which helps in breaking the amino acid oligopeptide further into carboxypeptidase and amino acid dipeptides. Now let us see the step by step protein digestions in different part of our body. First, let's see the protein digestion in the stomach. Stomach is having acids like hydrochloric acid and gastric juices. This hydrochloric acid makes the stomach's environment acidic. This acidic environment is very useful for the enzymes which are present in the stomach to digest the protein. For example, stomach is having pepsin enzyme which is the active form of pepsinogen. This pepsinogen which is the inactive form of pepsin convert or turns into active pepsin enzyme only in the acidic environment. The pepsin enzyme converts protein into large polypeptide chain. Infants have renin in their stomach. This renin enzyme helps in converting the complex protein present in the milk into simpler protein. They help in converting milk protein casein to calcium paracaseinate. Then they are further digested by pepsin. Thus, stomach enzymes convert complex protein into long polypeptide chains. Now this protein which is in the form of long polypeptide chain goes into the duodenum of the intestine. Polypeptide chains are digested by pancreatic juice and bile juice by zymogens. Zymogens are the group of enzymes like trypsinogen, chymotrypsin and carboxypeptidase. The trypsinogen is converted into trypsin enzyme by enterokinase enzymes. This trypsin enzyme helps in activating other enzymes like carboxypeptidase by self-activation process. These enzymes convert the large polypeptide chains to a small polypeptide chain. Carboxypeptidase cleave the COOH terminal of the amino acid. Thus, duodenum of the intestine and pancreatic juice breaks long peptide chains into small peptide chains. Now let us see what happens when the simplified protein goes into the ileum of the intestine. Enzymes present are dipeptidase and aminopeptidase. They convert small peptide chain into amino acids, dipeptides and tripeptides. Then they are further transported to liver where these amino acids are stored and produce other macromolecules like DNA and RNA. Small amount of dietary protein is lost in the feces. This slide shows the activation of pancreatic protease. Chymotrypsin and trypsin are important pancreatic enzymes that convert long chain amino acid into short chain. Now let us see the importance of protein digestion. It helps in producing necessary amino acid and thus the source of energy also helps in bodybuilding and in the formation of hormones and enzymes DNA RNA synthesis helps in repairing the tissue damage transporting molecules such as oxygen and carbon dioxide through protein channels build the immune system by developing antibodies also helps in maintaining the pH balance in the blood now let us see what are the factors which affects the protein digestion the first factor is the pH of the digestive system. pH is the most common factor that affects the digestion of protein. 
in the stomach the protein digestion occur in the acidic ph and in the intestine the protein digestion occur in the alkaline or basic ph this ph is maintained by sodium bicarbonate the next factor is sodium bicarbonate in the duodenum food stuffs comes in the duodenum from the stomach pancreatic juice is released that contain pancreatic enzymes such as trypsin chymotrypsin and elastase which are endopeptidase active at neutral ph gastric hcl is neutralized by pancreatic sodium bicarbonate in the intestine and this create a favorable ph for the action of protease another factor that affects the protein digestion is the hormone some hormones are involved in the digestion process and initiate enzyme activity like secretin other factors that affects protein digestion are substrate specificity and dependency on zinc ion that is all for the protein digestion if you like my video please subscribe my channel science query thank you